Hi everybody, so I just wanted to make a quick video on my new Japanese doll that I got for my birthday. Um, in my earlier video I had, I had asked you guys to help me pick a name for her. And <clears throat> the name that I have decided is Sakura. S-A-K-U-R-A. -A, Sakura. And the person who suggested that name to me was Mr. Camillamil. Sorry if I said that wrong, but um, I'll put the name of the person's YouTube channel down below in the description bar. And so I wanted to thank that person for helping me choose her name. I think it goes really well with her. And if you guys didn't know, Sakura means cherry blossom in Japanese. So <clears throat> I thought that it um, went well with um, her kimono because cherry blossoms are like a pinkish color. So... Once again, thank you, Mr. Camilla Mill, for um, helping me choose the name. And this is what she looks like outside the box. I haven't taken the plastic off yet because um, I'm going to put her where I already have the spot for her. I just have to like put her there and then I'll take the plastic off. Um, this is... I'm going to turn her around. It's really pretty. And just so you guys know, the doll is glued to the base. I don't know if you can see, but her it's a black base. You can see that. She's glued to that, which is good because if there's one thing I really, really, really don't like is when my dolls are in their doll stands and I have to take them out of their doll stands when I have to move them around. I really don't like that. So it's good that she comes glued with this, although I can't really play with her because she's a collector's item. But occasionally I'll let her have some fun with my other dolls. So this is what Sakura looks like. And thank you all for watching. Um, I'm not sure what my next video will be on, but uh, I'll be making one whenever I can. So, once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye!